Hey, this is Kaz from Spiderweb Press. In the last video, we started to get the uh, the logo and the site title and the tagline all formatted and looking nice. And now the last area to tweak in the header is the RSS icon here. So we're going to replace that with something that matches the design and the, the layout of this header area. So switching over to the website weaver, uh, just quickly before we do anything at all, I am going to generate new theme defaults. It's really good practice as you go along to pretty much every time you do something that you like and you know you want to keep to generate new theme defaults. So what this does is it creates a backup point in your design. So whenever you want to, you can just hit the reset to theme defaults and you can go back to that save point. So, you know, if you accidentally mess something up or you take the design in a direction that you, that you don't like and you change your mind and you want to go back, then it's always really good to have as many of these default points uh, created along the way as you can remember to do. So now that's done, I'm going to replace the RSS icon. So open up the header settings panel and you can see here it says RSS. So this is the area to edit your RSS icon. And just scrolling down to the RSS icon uh, settings area, just hit the upload button. Browse to your RSS file. Now this is one that I made in Photoshop to, to suit the design that I want to go for, but there are loads of free RSS files out there. If you just do a Google search for free RSS icon, or go to findicons.com, you'll find that there is a huge amount to choose from. So this is my little RSS icon here that I've created so that it matches the, the height of the title. So I can get a nice, nice balanced look going. And I'm just going to adjust the positioning of these elements a little more so that it fits in nicely with the new icon. And now I'm going to save that and update the theme with those settings. And you can see on the front end now, you have your custom RSS icon and you can see the layout is starting to become quite tight and quite well balanced. That will automatically be linked to the RSS feed for your WordPress site so you don't have to worry about manually applying a link. You just upload the RSS icon and everything else is handled automatically. And that is all it takes to add a custom RSS icon. Thanks!